You know that moment when you finally lie down, tell yourself you'll sleep early tonight, and somehow it's 3 a.m. again. You wake up with your eyes burning, your mind heavy, and whisper the same promise you made yesterday. I'll fix my sleep tomorrow. But tomorrow never comes. Yet there's always that one person who says, I only sleep five hours and I feel amazing. How is that even possible? Today, let's explore the science and psychology behind how some people sleep less and still wake up clear, calm, and fully alive. Truth 1. It's not about hours, it's about efficiency. Your brain doesn't count hours, it counts patterns. Every 90 minutes, it moves through a full sleep cycle, from light sleep to deep sleep to REM, like a quiet symphony of restoration. Deep sleep repairs your body, muscles, tissues, immune system. REM sleep repairs your brain, focus, creativity, emotional regulation. When these cycles are smooth and uninterrupted, even 5.5 or 6 hours can give you full recovery. But if your sleep is fragmented, from blue light, late caffeine, or racing thoughts, you can sleep 9 hours and still feel like your mind never really shut down. Your body needs duration. Your mind needs rhythm. Real rest isn't about how long you sleep, it's about how efficiently your brain moves through its natural rhythm. Step 1. Strengthen your biological clock. Think of your brain like a conductor leading an orchestra. It performs best when the rhythm never changes. Going to bed and waking up at the same time each day trains your circadian rhythm, your internal biological clock, to anticipate rest instead of being forced into it. When you keep a consistent sleep schedule, your brain starts releasing melatonin automatically at the right time. Your heartbeat slows, your body temperature drops, and the mind transitions gently from alertness to calm. But when your sleep hours shift randomly, you sleep at 11 p.m. one night, 2 a.m. the next, your brain doesn't know when to shut down. Cortisol, your stress hormone, remains elevated. Deep sleep becomes lighter, shorter, and less restorative. So create a fixed rhythm, even on weekends. You're not just managing sleep, you're teaching your body to trust consistency. A reliable rhythm makes your mornings shockingly fresh, because your mind already knows when to wake. Step 2. Design your environment for rest. Your brain learns through context. Every sound, every color, every source of light sends signals that either calm you or keep you alert. A dark, quiet, and slightly cool room tells your nervous system it's safe now, you can let go. Studies show that temperatures between 18 and 20 degrees Celsius help your body fall asleep faster and spend more time in deep, restorative sleep. Dim, warm lights, the same tone as sunset, help your eyes produce melatonin naturally. Soft background noise or silence keeps your brain from scanning for danger. Your room doesn't just hold your bed, it holds your subconscious cues for peace. We underestimate how much our senses teach our brain to relax. So let your space tell one story. That rest is not a luxury, it's the next chapter of your day. Step 3. The 60-Minute Wind-Down Ritual Rest doesn't begin when your eyes close. It begins when you choose to disconnect. The last hour before bed decides whether your mind slips easily into deep sleep or wrestles with chaos in silence. Try the 3 2, one method. Three hours before bed, no heavy meals or alcohol. Two hours before, stop work, arguments, or anything stressful. One hour before, put away all screens. The light from your phone keeps your brain in day mode, telling it to stay awake. Replace that noise with soft rituals. Write down three things you're grateful for. Listen to calm music around 60 to 80 beats per minute. Stretch gently or read something light. When practiced consistently, these signals form a mental bridge. 
one that connects a busy day to a peaceful night. Your body learns to rest before you even fall asleep. Step 4. Wake up the right way. The first 10 minutes after waking are more powerful than most people realize. Instead of reaching for your phone, reach for sunlight. Step outside or stand near a bright window. That light tells your brain the day has begun. It suppresses melatonin, the sleep hormone, and boosts serotonin, which lifts mood and motivation. If you want to clear morning grogginess fast, splash your face with cold water, or move, push-ups, jumping jacks, even a quick stretch. Within three minutes, your heart rate rises and your brain floods with dopamine and noradrenaline, the chemistry of alertness and focus. It's not caffeine that wakes you up, it's movement, light, and meaning. When your morning starts with natural energy, your body learns that less sleep doesn't have to mean less life. Sleep isn't a sign of weakness. It's your body's most intelligent act of repair. While you rest, your brain organizes memories, balances emotions, and rebuilds the focus you'll need for tomorrow. You don't need more hours. You need more clarity within those hours. Because one morning, when you wake up before your alarm, eyes open, mind calm, you'll realize something powerful. You never needed more time. You just needed real rest. If this helped you understand yourself better, subscribe for more Psychology Explained.